pew, 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 pew. What are you doing? I'm getting pumped. For what? I'll explain after we do the intro, okay? Good afternoon, Tarleton State, and welcome to another episode of Texan Entertainment News. I'm Jack Cochran. And I'm Amy Nash. Okay, now I'll explain. Cartoon Network has announced officially that the Powerpuff Girls are being rebooted in 2016. Seriously, that's what you get, you're you getting excited for? I could tell Professor Utonium skipped the sugar when he was making you. Anyway, there aren't too many details about this yet. The Powerpuff Girls, for those who don't know, was an award-winning series about three superheroines who saved the city of Townsville from trouble and always made sure to do so before bedtime. It was brought back with a special called Dance Pants to 2014, and a little known fact is that it was also remade as an anime in Japan and some other countries called Powerpuff Girls Z, and it was astronomically different. But now Cartoon Network will be combining sugar, spice, everything nice, and knocking the chemical X in again to bring back the classic series. Keep an eye out for the new Powerpuff reboot in 2016. Parks and Rec co-executive producer Harris Whittles was found dead on Thursday in his home in Los Angeles. He was 30 years old and the cause of his death has yet to be determined. Whittles has worked in the past on other shows besides Parks and Rec, such as the Sarah Silverman program. A Los Angeles Police Department representative told the Huffington Post that Whittles was found around 12 p.m. on Thursday. We'll have more on this as more information comes in. Well, something magical happened on Monday. Something so great that the heavens quaked and Miley Cyrus put clothes on. Texan Entertainment News opened a blog. 10 Posts on Tumblr is now our home for discussions, analyses, and deeper looks at movies, video games, music, and more. 10 Posts will be updated semi-daily as the job allows. So far, we've had two posts and a follow-up. Go check out 10 Posts today to see my review on the new SpongeBob SquarePants movie and a discussion about World of Warcraft and its recent 10-year anniversary. And keep an eye out for a review of Lights' Little Machines Dallas concert and an exclusive interview with her also appearing on 10 Posts. Other than that, that's all we've got for you today. Follow the Texan News Service on Twitter and Facebook and like Texan Entertainment News on Facebook. Have a good afternoon, Tarleton State.